Kim is going viral, guys, for her stint in, you know, Paris. And of course, Kylie is being questioned by the papers and the people yet again. Hey guys, it's Morali Morali. Hopefully you guys are all doing well today. Back at it again with another video. If you have not subscribed, it is daily and consistent content. Let's get straight into this video, guys. Consistent and persistent, baby. Let's get straight into this video. So yet again, guys, Kim has gone viral. She's done what she needs to do. This girl is a PR marketing queen. You have to hold your hands up to, you know, to say well done to somebody like her. He was only in Paris literally for 24 hours or less, got in there for the Balenciaga show and went straight out with this outfit that she was wearing where she was taped up. You guys have must have already seen it right now if you guys haven't. She's taped up completely in Balenciaga, um, you know, yellow, black. And she has gone viral in a video someone has taken, which has accumulated nearly 4.5 million views of her simply trying to um, walk and she's struggling because the clothes that she's wearing are just so simply tight on her. You see her sitting like right next to Anna Winter. Um, there's a guy who's the director, then Anna Winter. Then you even have Alexa from Euphoria who's in that particular area as well, which is great that she's even in those circles. But the fact that she's gone viral from something so small, something so quick, her job was done. Everybody is speaking about her and yet she was there for way less than what anybody expected for literally being there for one show and you've gone viral because you're struggling to walk and there's noise from your outfit as it glides, the friction, and you know, you're know you waddling like a penguin. It's just quite funny that just from that particular clip, you've gone viral and that's exactly what she wanted, exactly what her mom wanted. Exactly what the PR queen wanted. Kodak, um, um, rapper Kodak Black has has been posting her as well, trying to move to her in a public way, saying that, you know, I would like to be with you, etc., etc., in this kind of flirtatious manner. And him doing stuff like that, or any rappers, any mainstream rappers doing stuff like that only helps Kim even more and helps to distract the conversation from Kanye and mission accomplished 110%. I think that was completely what they wanted to do and it worked. Now, was that a gig with Corey? Um, people are quite confused by it because she's been slammed by fans for grinding on her mother, Chris, um, um, Chris Jenner's um, boyfriend, Corey Gamble, at a concert in a resurfaced video. In, in a clip, Kylie24 attended a concert with friends um, and Corey, one of her gal pals, recorded the group dancing along to the music and they said that Corey danced beside her as his girlfriend's daughter appeared to be sexually moving her body against his. The actions caught the attention of many Reddit users after one posted about the weird action, um, the weird interaction in the old clip. Somebody wrote, anybody else find it weird that Kylie was acting like this in front, front of Corey and allegedly even grinded on him? Um, others seemed to agree as a slew of comments followed pointing out the family's relationship dynamic. Everything in this family does is hypersexualized and incest-like. It's extremely disturbing the way the sisters grope each other any chance they get. So people find it very weird. I do find it interesting that, um, you know, Corey's still in the family. Corey's still in the family. You know, TMZ reported that, that of course, um, you know, Christian has not done with him. But the fact that, you know, he's still there after videos have come out, conversations have happened, and, you know, I feel like Chris needs to respect herself and get with somebody else. Like, you can dump this man and find somebody that you would prefer. I don't think you would need someone like Corey Gamble. And the fact that nobody knows about this man's family um, and you've been with him, I think that in itself should raise a lot of questions. And it definitely seems shifty and opportunist kind of vibes. And I'm quite shocked that she's still with the man. If, if we want to be real for a minute, it is quite shocking that she's still with him. Yeah. Let me know your thoughts are, guys, when it comes to this video. Subscribe to the channel, click that button. It is daily and consistent content, baby. And I will catch you guys soon for another video.